Welcome to the interview, Richard. Can you start off and tell me about yourself? Yes, well, uh, my name's Richard. I'm 35 years old. I live in England and I'm a good team worker, professional, and I really think I could do a great job for your company. Please do not use that answer when introducing yourself right at the very start of your job interview. Now, a lot of you have been reaching out to me in the comments below the videos, and you have been asking me to explain the difference between introduce yourself and tell me about yourself. Now, there is a difference between these two questions, and it's really important to understand what that difference is before you attend your interview. So right at the very start of your job interview, the hiring manager will either say, introduce yourself or tell me about yourself. And your answer to whichever question that they ask you is so important for creating a positive first impression. So if you have a job interview coming up soon for any role or any company, make sure you stay tuned because I promise to help you be the standout candidate. And just very quickly, if you are new to the channel, please make sure you hit that subscribe button. I can then help you pass every job interview you ever attend and also negotiate a salary. And please give the video a like because that tells me you find these tutorials useful. Thank you very much. Let's jump straight into the presentation. So to help you pass your job interview at the first attempt, I will cover the following four things during this tutorial. Tutorial. Number one, I will explain the difference between the interview questions, introduce yourself and tell me about yourself. I will then tell you what to include in your answer to each interview question and I will also give you a very easy structure to remember for each one. Number three, I will then give you a brilliant example answer to introduce yourself and tell me about yourself in a live job interview. And then finally, number four, I will tell you where you can instantly download the answers. So to begin with, what is the difference between the interview questions, tell me about yourself and introduce yourself? Well, the main difference is the fact that tell me about yourself is more in depth and it covers things such as the skills and qualities you have, any previous work experience gained, academic and educational qualifications, and what you will do in the role if they hire you. The introduce yourself interview question, on the other hand, is a brief introduction of who you are, the words you would use to describe yourself, and the key strengths you possess that will be of benefit in the workplace. So let me now tell you what to include in your answer to the interview questions, tell me about yourself and introduce yourself. And I will then give you a brilliant example answer for each question in a live interview. So if the interviewer says to you at the start of your job interview, tell me about yourself. My advice is to use the SEAT format to structure your answer, S-E-A-T. Now SEAT stands for the skills you have that match the job description, the experience and or educational qualifications you have, any previous significant achievements you have gained in your life so far, and also the type of person you will be whilst working for their company. So let me now give you a brilliant example answer in a live interview to the question, tell me about yourself, and we will then move on to the introduce yourself question. Tell me about yourself. Thank you for giving me the opportunity to be interviewed for this position today with your company. I already have the skills and qualities to match the job description. I am industrious, hardworking, an excellent team worker and collaborator, and I can easily prioritize tasks to ensure my employer's goals are always achieved. I have experience working on time-sensitive projects, dealing with difficult challenges, and communicating with customers and clients to help resolve any issues they have and meet their needs. I have a track record of achievement. For example, in my last role, I helped the company increase sales by recommending we should advertise our products and services on social media. If you hire me, I will be the type of person who will always go above and beyond what is expected and I will willingly carry out duties that are outside of my job description. So that's a brilliant example answer in a live job interview to the question, tell me about yourself, that uses the SEAT format, S-E-A-T. Skills, 
educational qualifications and experience, any achievements you have gained in your life and the type of person you are. Let me quickly give you that script and we will then move on to the question, introduce yourself. Here we go. Tell me about yourself. Thank you for giving me the opportunity to be interviewed for this position with your company today. I already have the skills and qualities to match the job description. I am industrious, hardworking, an excellent team worker and collaborator, and I can easily prioritize tasks to ensure my employer's goals are always achieved. I have experience working on time-sensitive projects, dealing with difficult challenges, and communicating with customers and clients. I have a track record of achievement. For example, in my last position, I helped the company increase sales by recommending we should advertise our products and services on social media. If you hire me, I will be the type of person who will always go above and beyond what is expected and I will willingly carry out duties outside of my job description. Now in a second, I will give you a brilliant structure to use and answer to the question introduce yourself but when you're ready you can click that link in the top right hand corner of the video head through to my website passmyinterview.com and you can instantly download my full set of 50 brilliant answers to difficult interview questions okay let's now move on to the introduce yourself interview question so if the interviewer asks you to introduce yourself at the very start of your interview use the beat format B E A T so B stands for your best three qualities. E stands for educational background. A stands for the activities and interests you have outside of work. And T stands for the one area of talent you have that will be of benefit to their company. So let me now give you a brilliant example response to the introduce yourself interview question in a live job interview, and I will then give you the script. Welcome to the interview, Richard. Can you start off and introduce yourself? Thank you. My name is Richard McMahon and my best qualities include my diligent way of working, my resourcefulness during difficult challenges and my loyalty to others, especially my employer. I graduated from college with useful educational qualifications in mathematics, English and computer science. Outside of work, I like to keep myself fit and active. I visit the gym several times a week, which helps to improve my concentration levels whilst I am at work, and it also increases positivity. I also like reading non-fiction books, which helps to develop my skills and knowledge. Now, one of my main talents, which I think will be of benefit to your company, is the fact I am very good with people, particularly customers, and I have the skill of asking them the right questions to assess their needs and then provide exceptional service, which helps to increase sales and retains customer loyalty. So that's a brilliant example response in a live interview to that question, introduce yourself, that uses the BEAT format, B-E-A-T. Let me now give you the script. Introduce yourself, here we go. Thank you, my name is Richard McMahon and my best qualities include my diligent way of working, my resourcefulness during difficult challenges and my loyalty to others, including my employer. I graduated from college with useful educational qualifications in English language, computer science and mathematics. Outside of work, I like to keep myself fit and active. I visit the gym several times a week, which helps my concentration levels and increases positivity. I also like reading non-fiction books, which helps to develop my skills and knowledge. One of my main talents, which I think will be of benefit to your company, is the fact I am very good with people, particularly customers, and I have a skill of asking the right questions to assess a customer's needs and then provide exceptional service, which helps increase sales and retains customer loyalty. Okay, so there's two brilliant responses to the tell me about yourself interview question and introduce yourself. Don't forget, it's really important that you give powerful answers to those questions to help you beat the competition and be the standout candidate. Now, the next thing to do 
if you want to accelerate your learning even further is click that link right now in the top right hand corner of the video head through to my website passmyinterview.com and you can instantly download my full set of 50 brilliant answers to difficult interview questions it's a fantastic resource and it's guaranteed to put you ahead of the competition at your forthcoming interview finally don't forget to hit the subscribe button literally thousands and thousands of you are passing your job interviews and I can only help you if you are subscribed please give the video a like because that tells me you find these tutorials useful and it also motivates me to create more content for you thank you very much and don't forget to connect with me on LinkedIn I've put my LinkedIn link in the description below the video and it's always a pleasure and an honor to connect with like-minded professionals such as yourself thank you so much for watching and for supporting my channel and I wish you all the best for passing your job interview have a great day